so I'm going through my dash cam to figure out what it recorded and what it didn't record. Um, it didn't record, um, broke back Dahmer today. when I, It got me pulling into the alley, but then backing up where he was, it didn't record any of that, which is weird. And usually my dash cam doesn't record for like 30 seconds left after I turn on the car, which is dumb. And then last night camping, it recorded driving to the campsite, driving around the campsites to check to where we want to camp at. And then I got in my car, turned my car off, went to pay at the front, got back in my car. We pulled into our camp spot. I usually get my fog lights on because they're bright, but they're not like disturbing bright. It's not like leaving headlights on and we weren't facing anybody. So I usually get my fog lights on. That way we can set up our camp, you know, get our coolers out, get our tents out, set up all the food. And my dash cam didn't record that. It's just a black video. It recorded literally driving to the campsite. It recorded driving around the campsite, but not the campsite. So already two videos my dash camera missed. So it's a piece of crap, basically. And sometimes it'll upload quickly, like it did today, and miss them. Or it'll take hours or the rest of the day or the next day to upload. So I don't know what it recorded. It's just a black screen for 12 minutes. I can see the fire going in the background. I, I don't know. Dude, don't buy a Nexar dash cam. Don't buy the Scotia one. Nothing with Nexar software. Don't get tricked into the unlimited storage bullcrap because it doesn't matter. If it doesn't record, it's useless. So, if you get an accident, you better hope it recorded. And I still can't share it from the app, no matter how many updates it does. So, next, I want to get a Garmin, but, you know... I wanted to buy my speakers, and I gotta get those in first, and I'm now broke again, so. Next will be a Garmin for sure, for sure, because this is just ridiculous, so. You're supposed to go to your phone, find the footage, and be able to share it, and you can't do any of that. And no matter how many updates, and no matter how many hours and weeks you spend with help, they just, they're useless. They're just like, oh, do you try this, do you try this, do you try this, and I asked them if I can return it and just get my money back, because it hasn't worked from day one. And then they basically just said because I bought it from Skosh that I have to contact them, which I need to keep forgetting to do. And I'm gonna make a complaint. This is like a lemon law. This thing is garbage. It hasn't worked from day one. And then they have to wait for the updates, which take forever. So by the time you get a couple updates in, it's already past return window. It's just stupid. It's horrible. Don't buy one. You want to pull your hair out if you have hair. 